Hello, my name is Joshua Brown from the expert interview training company, howtobecome.com. And in this presentation, I will teach you how to pass your structural engineer interview. So if you have a structural engineering interview coming up for any organization, then please make sure you watch this video from start to finish because I promise to help you stand out and succeed. To achieve that goal, this is what I'll cover. I'll start off by giving you a list of structural engineer interview questions that I strongly recommend you prepare for. I'll then provide you with example high scoring answers to all of those questions to ensure you succeed at the first attempt. I'll also make sure to give you some essential tips for passing your structural engineer interview before finally telling you how you can instantly download these slides plus 30 great answers to structural engineer interview questions in a PDF guide. And just very quickly, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I want to help you pass your interview by giving you brilliant answers to the toughest structural engineer interview questions. And I can only do that if you are subscribed. And please don't forget to hit that like button because this tells me you find these tutorials useful. Okay, let's start off by taking a look at that opening interview question for your structural engineer interview. And that's tell me about yourself, or it may be phrased as introduce yourself. Now, this is a brilliant opportunity to get your interview off to a flying start and really impress the hiring manager. You can be the standout candidate by focusing your answer on the skills and qualities that you have. Do not talk about your home life or your personal life unless it's relevant to the job role itself that you're applying for. Instead, focus on your experience and your passion for working in the role and tell the hiring manager how you're going to add value to their company in the job role. And a great and simple way to do all of these things, a really easy way, is to make sure you study the job description in detail and focus on telling the hiring manager how your skills are a perfect match to those that they desire. So for example, if on the job description, it states they're seeking someone who is analytical with great attention to detail abilities and great communication abilities, then throughout your structural engineer interview answers, be sure to use those exact terms. Back it up with previous examples of where you've demonstrated those skills and qualities in previous experience. Okay, let me give you a top scoring answer to that interview question that's going to make you the standout candidate. Tell me about yourself. Thank you for the opportunity to interview today. I am a professional, hardworking and resilient structural engineer with over 10 years of experience. I take great pride in the quality of my work and the high standards I consistently achieve for my employer. Over the years, I have gained extensive experience in structural design and analysis, leading high profile projects, including high rise buildings and large scale infrastructure at ABC Engineering. My expertise includes seismic design, finite element analysis and sustainable material utilization and I'm proficient in SAP 2000, eTabs and Revit. I absolutely love my work as a structural engineer and I'm dedicated to producing innovative and safe solutions. In addition to my technical skills, I possess outstanding communication and interpersonal abilities, enabling me to build strong relationships with clients, contractors and stakeholders. If I am successful in my application to join your team, I assure you that I will work diligently to produce consistently strong and professional results that reflect well on your organization. Wow, what a powerful way to kickstart your interview and really be that standout candidate. Remember, by giving a confident answer like this to that opening interview question, not only will you impress the hiring manager, but you'll also gain confidence in the rest of your answers to come. Okay, let's take a look at the next structural engineering interview question, which is, in your opinion, what are the most important skills needed to be a structural engineer? Now you're being asked this interview question because the hiring manager wants to understand your awareness of the key competencies required for success in this role. So my top tip here is to focus on technical proficiency, attention to detail, problem solving abilities, and communication skills, because this will enable you to demonstrate a comprehensive understanding of the role's demands. Again, let's take a look at a great top scoring answer to help you. In your opinion, what are the most important skills needed to be a structural engineer? 
In my opinion, the most important skills needed to be a structural engineer include a strong foundation in structural analysis and design principles, along with proficiency in engineering software such as AutoCAD, eTabs and SAP 2000. Attention to detail is crucial to ensure the safety and integrity of structures. Problem solving skills are essential for developing innovative solutions to complex engineering challenges. A thorough understanding of building codes and regulations is necessary for compliance and safety. Effective communication and teamwork abilities are vital for collaborating with clients, contractors and multidisciplinary teams. Project management skills, including time and budget management, are important for successful project execution. Additionally, adaptability to new technologies and methods, coupled with a commitment to ethical standards and sustainability, ensures long-term success and professional integrity in the field. Now don't go anywhere as I still have plenty more structural engineering interview questions and answers to give you in this video, but when you're ready, and only if you want to, you can click that link in the top right hand corner or in the pinned comment below this video. It will take you through to my website, howtobecome.com, where you can download my top 30 structural engineer interview questions and answers for all organizations to give you the edge in your interview. Okay, let's take a look at the next structural engineer interview question. Why do you want to work for us? Now, this is a very common interview question and it's being asked to determine your motivation, knowledge about the company and how you align with its values and goals. Make sure you spend the time to research the company before you apply. Take five minutes, five, 10 minutes to look at their website, have a look at their about us page, their social media channels, look at their latest news stories and familiarize yourself with the products and services the company offers and the historical structures and projects it's completed. Then when answering this interview question, you can express genuine interest in the company's projects and values and explain how your skills and aspirations align with their goals. Let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to help you ace this interview question. Why do you want to work for us? I am excited about the opportunity to work for your esteemed company because of your reputation for innovative and sustainable structural solutions. Your commitment to cutting edge technology and high standards of excellence aligns perfectly with my professional values and career aspirations. I am particularly impressed by your diverse portfolio of challenging projects and your collaborative work environment, which fosters continuous learning and professional growth. I am eager to contribute my expertise in structural analysis and design, leveraging my experience with advanced engineering software to help drive your project to success. Joining your team would allow me to work alongside some of the best minds in the industry, further hone my skills and make meaningful contributions to pioneering structural engineering solutions. Okay, let's take a look at another structural engineering interview question. This one is a behavioral interview question. Tell me about a situation when you solved a technical problem. Now this question is being asked to evaluate your problem solving skills and your ability to apply technical knowledge effectively. A great tip here is to structure your answer using the STAR method, S-T-A-R-R. -R. Now the STAR method is a brilliant way to structure your interview answers to any behavioral interview question, any question that starts with, Tell me about a time when. Can you describe a situation when you face this? When you need to draw on past experience, use that STAR method. So the STAR method stands for this. S is for situation. You start off by describing what the situation was that you found yourself in. T is for task. You then talk about the task. What was the task that needed to be carried out? A is for action. What action did you take to achieve the task? The first R is for result. What was the end result following your actions? Make sure it's always a positive end result. And the final R is for reflection. What did you learn from this experience? This is a brilliant and highly effective way to structure your answers. So let me give you a brilliant answer to that interview question using the STAR method. Tell me about a situation when you solved a technical problem. While working on a multi-story commercial building project, we discovered a significant design flaw in the structural model that could compromise the building's stability. As the lead structural engineer, 
I needed to quickly identify a solution to ensure the project stayed on schedule and met safety standards. I conducted a thorough analysis using eTabs to pinpoint the issue and collaborated with my team to redesign the affected structural components. We implemented advanced load distribution techniques and reinforced key areas. The revised design not only corrected the floor, but also enhanced the building's overall stability and efficiency. This experience reinforced the importance of meticulous analysis and teamwork in solving complex technical problems, ensuring project success and safety. Okay, the next structural engineer interview question I have for you is this. Why do you want to be a structural engineer? Again, a very common interview question and it's asked to gauge your passion for the field and to understand your long-term career motivations. That's really important because they don't want to hire someone who doesn't want to be a structural engineer for the long term and who doesn't want to work for them for the long term. So make sure you share your genuine passion for structural engineering, emphasizing your interest in creating safe, innovative and sustainable structures. Okay, here's my top scoring answer to help you. Why do you want to be a structural engineer? I want to be a structural engineer because I'm passionate about designing and creating structures that are both functional and aesthetically pleasing, while ensuring they are safe and sustainable. From a young age, I've been fascinated by how buildings and bridges are constructed, and this led me to pursue a degree in civil engineering. The combination of creativity and technical expertise required in this field excites me. I thrive on solving complex problems and seeing tangible results from my efforts. Structural engineering allows me to make a positive impact on communities by contributing to the development of resilient and innovative infrastructure. I am driven by the challenge of turning architectural visions into reality and the opportunity to improve the built environment for future generations. Now, in preparation for your structural engineer interview, I also recommend you prepare answers to the following interview questions. Can you describe a challenging project you worked on and how you handled it? How do you ensure compliance with building codes and regulations in your projects? How do you prioritize safety in your structural engineering projects? Can you explain a time when you had to use your problem solving skills on a project? How do you stay current with advancements in structural engineering technology and practices? How do you approach the design of a new structure to ensure it meets all functional and aesthetic requirements. Describe a time when you had to manage a conflict within your project team. How did you handle it? How do you handle tight deadlines and ensure that project milestones are met on time? Can you discuss a project where sustainability was a key focus? How did you incorporate sustainable practices into your design? How do you handle feedback and criticism on your engineering work? So the next thing to do if you want to get the full list of all 30 structural engineer interview questions and if you want to accelerate your learning even further to pass your interview at the first attempt then click that link in the top right hand corner of the video or in the pinned comment below the video for two reasons. The first reason is it will take you through to my website howtobecome.com where you can get all of these answers we just covered plus a total of 30 brilliant responses to structural engineer interview questions in a PDF guide. And secondly, the next reason is, I've given you three smart questions to ask at the end of your structural engineer interview on that page. It's a brilliant resource, guaranteed to help you prepare effectively for your interview, and also more importantly, put you ahead of the competition. Make sure you check out that link. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Please don't forget to subscribe as I'm on a mission to help as many people as possible pass their job interviews and I can only do that if you are subscribed. Please also hit that like button as that really does encourage me to make more videos just like these. If you have any questions regarding any specific organization or job role, do let me know in the comment section below where I'll get back to you with even more interview tips and advice. I literally respond to every single person who leaves a comment on my channel, so please do feel free to reach out to me there. And finally, don't forget to connect with me on LinkedIn I put my LinkedIn link in the description below. It's always great to connect with like-minded professionals such as yourself. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best with your interview. Have a brilliant day.